Hi, good day to all of you. This is Wendy Majusi Flores of Sampara Elementary School. Today, I'm going to introduce to you and orient you with our project dream. This is about development on of reading enhancement and awareness material on gun, gender and development in school. So, this is my <coughs> new um, project in school to be attained at this school year 2021-2022. So I have I only have six months to implement this project. So this is about gender and development. Why is it I am having this project? Because um, nowadays uh, we need to educate the the young people, the grade uh, graders, the elementary pupils at this early so that they will know about the gender in development, the gender in role, and the importance of of doing both roles to help us alleviate us all from poverty, from violence, and to make us successful early in life. So, gender is an important consideration in development. It is a way of looking at how social norms in power structures impact on the lives and opportunities available to different groups of men and women. And mostly, we are typecast as men and women and having stereotypes. So, this is the thing that a woman can do. This is the thing a man should do. And so, in in the... In their houses, ang mga, ang mga parents ay hindi makagawa ng ganito. Hindi pwedeng maglaba ang lalaki, hindi pwedeng maglaba ang mga babae. And the same thing, uh, these things were looked up by the pupils or by the kids, by the young pupils in their houses. So, hindi ito gagawin ni Buknoy kasi hindi ito ginagawa ni tatay niya. Hindi ito gagawin ni nanay, ay ni Diday kasi hindi ito ginagawa ni nanay niya. So, these are the things that we should correct if kailangan nating itama or kailangan nating i-guide ang mga bata as early as their young age. Okay. So, gender role focus on social construction of identities within the household. So, since dito tayo nagsisimula sa bahay, so kailangan nating ipaalam muna, especially sa parents. So, kailangan din nating ipanoorin itong mga tungkol natin sa mga gender and development dahil sila ang actually ang first teacher of the pupils in their houses. So, itong mga identities na ito, it also reveals the expectations from maleness and femaleness and their relative access to resources. So, the mission of the Department of Education is to provide quality education that is equitably accessible to all and lay the foundation for lifelong learning and service for the common good. So, for all, for men and women, weak and strong. And if it's all, it's not only favored to who is stronger and weak, gender it's for all weak and strong okay so gender development or god refers to the development and perspective and process that are participatory and empowering equitable sustainable free from violence respectful of human rights, supportive of self-determination and actualization of human potential it is not because babae siya mahina siya ay hindi na siya makaka-achieve ng gusto niyang gawin sa buhay. So, even it shows that educators need to have gender awareness to be open to girls and boys, choices in learning development. Help children be aware not only of gender role but of gender equality and unity to be free from abuse and discrimination on both gender. The proponent aims to make pupils and parents aware of the importance of developing of understanding the gender in development, God in school. So she will develop mechanisms that will help her update this. She will make God display bulletin board in the conspicuous places in the school that parents may read, leaflets and storybooks with gender and development things, modules using gender and development things. Okay. So this project of aims to develop pupil awareness to gender equality, to develop understanding on gender in development, and to improve the attitude toward gender roles. Okay, so what are the, the steps? So, 
First is that on this on January 2022, last month, I have secured, I have written, secured, and have an approved proposal. So this time we are going, we are having this orientation to you and to all my co-workers in the school. So next is provision of bulletin boards for guide announcement and information. So I have there in our school a uh, provision of bulletin boards. So specifically, Palaver have to specifically we have to uh, put up a uh, guide bulletin boards announcement and information. So lahat ng makukuha ko magagather ko on social media and on books ay gagawin natin. Ipuput natin yung sa bulletin board. Next is to involve teachers on development of modules and leaflet and storybooks on God. Demonstration teaching using God materials. Pupils take home quiz B. So magkaka-quiz B kayo mga bata. And reading story or storytelling contest on God. So gagawin nyo ito at the end of this. After na ma-edit yung mga stories na susulatin ko. Help me God. Okay. So it is expected that this year this school year this project will be implemented okay so this will be monitored and evaluated by your strolly as a school head and of course as a proponent and this will be uh, distributed also the the reading materials will be distributed also to parents and also this project dream will be sustained and maintained in the school through the continuation this through time frame and then she will encourage the colleagues to conduct reading assistance to children so that the project will be more effective. So it's a part, it's still a part of reading. If the pupils cannot read, they cannot participate in this kind of project.